Welcome back my comrades, I am Victor Barisov and today we are continuing Fallout 76 playthrough day 52 or 53 this is today and we are now recording June is April and Fallout 76 is a bit better fixed now so hopefully I won't get any more bad problems with it so let me just start the timer on my clock and check if everything's recording so yep that's recording that's fine, let me just see if it picks up any gun sounds. Don't think that did, let me just quick check. No, we'll just be on the safe side. I am actually not involved in the level. There we go. Now we should be all good. So today we are liberating this complex from hostile forces. And I've changed up my character a little. Just to give you a heads up, I have been using it. Oh, put your weapon away. That's it. Uh, for combat armor, but if you weren't wondering why I'm wearing the leather armor as well, it's for the chameleon perk. So I can go invisible. I am working on getting chameleon combat chest piece and the rest of it. So that should be fun. But we're not going to be using this stone's facility due to the fact it's highly hostile. We're going to be using some power armor. So let's jump into this, hop down there and kick some butt, shall we? Seems like fun. Let me just do a test. Yep, that seems to be picking up my voice. Yeah. Right, so down here we go. First first hostile force is right there. Destroying the bar, nice end shot, very professional. Oh god, they're now moving around down there. So what I want to do. Let's see if we can just land somewhere there. Let's get out the good old axe ready. And tron them all. Yo, hostiles. We're here to kick some butt. Should we bring out my other power armor I have got? Leave West Tech here. Oh god, these ones can actually speak ish. Uh, okay, this is a new one. These can speak. God. I'm being beaten up to the back now. Stay back. I do not want to hurt you, but you have occupied a research facility we need access to. It's all. You're all gonna die today, I can say that. I think that was an RPG one just went flying past. Not, there we go. That'll do some damage. Strong attack. There we go. Right. We still being shot. Probably from further up the field or from down below. Yep, they've got RPGs. These guys are not friendlies. Oof. Got it. Assault rifle out. Uh -huh. Got him, I dead. That's my stim packs. Who's firing the rock launch? You're dead. Oh god, I finally used my hindsight. Yeah, this is terrible. And I've only got one bullet left, so I may as well just randomly waste that. Ah, uh, no, they're dead. Oh, I just got some more ammo for it. That's handy. Oh, learn the secrets of West Tech. Okay, I guess it is a quest mission. Also, I need to get my friend to play. Not like doing a video or anything guys, because I looked at my original bear character who I've not used in a very long time. Turns out that character has hundreds of fusion cores and a ton of good chameleon armor and other combat armor pieces. So I'm like, yeah buddy, I kind of need you on someday soon so I can just transfer all the way to my this character, my YouTube one. So I think that equipment might be coming more handy for this guy. So my bear character, I did start off YouTube with that one, just to show some bear fudge and the rest, but then I kind of started fresh complete new story as you would say. So that one I just rushed through and went straight to the same asylum and got killed quite a bit. Uh -huh. Let's have a look. So this is the rooftop ballot. So we'll secure the roof then secure the outer grounds. Let's see what we can find. Let's get the loose screw. Hopefully we're not going to die. So let's reload some weaponry. Uh, Wooden crate. I said it's already been jarred open, but oh well. 
nothing really valuable in there right now. Where is he? Flap limbs. I know I've got disease. Yeah, I spawned in with that disease for some strange reason. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing from spawning with them on. But oh well. Let's have a look. God, these roofs are complicated by the looks of it. I'd hate to be the engineers working on this facility. Fair enough for us, the Atomic Specs and Rangers of the Federation only has to secure the facility, then the engineers and the rest come in and mob up. For us. Nope. Up. Toolbox here. And some more screws, I'm guessing. Yes, yeah, screws are always handy. What's down here? Yeah, anything? Nope, just looks like a dead end. Right, you know, it's a tear looking on. Looks like someone's camp. Is set up here some beer, some teddy bears, some paint. Hmm, nothing much of value though. There is a light shining up there though, so let's head up to that. Well, that light's almost says. Huh, looks like someone's painting studio. Very nice artwork. Might have to call the rec team in to come and scavenge these and take them back to base. Might be fun to have some new artwork lying around. For now, let's head over here. Oh god, we just fell off. Balancing and power armor is not the easiest thing to do. So up. Giant spotlight. Uh, binoculars, radio. Ooh. Perfectly preserved pyre. Didn't even have to work for that one. So that's handy. Uh, can we get on top of this other building here? Or do we need the can Do we need, like, the perk? Yeah, we gonna probably need the perk to get on this one. Jumping one. So I don't think my car is high enough. Nope. Oh well. Let's continue going back around this way then. Yeah, my car is like not tall enough to jump up there. So anyway, we're gonna jump back down here. Land on the ground and continue our sweep of the outer perimeter. So we've got one side doll there. Unless there were some giant tanks there for something. Hello. What's down here? Okay, a dead body with some ammo and a hunting rifle. Nice. If I find a stash box, I might get out my other power armor. So I've got T-51B military grade combat power armor now. I just found a full half of a suit. I'm missing one leg. Literally, I found a full suit just missing one leg. I know, so I'm gonna have to look for one leg now for that one. Oh. Open fire! So there we go, we took out two instantaneously. That's the turret dead anyway. Oh god, dogs. Hi, change gun. Bang, and that one's out of the corner. Uh, do I have my No, I don't have my sniper, which makes it bro. Right, yeah, this is gonna be interesting. This is the axe then. This is the axe. Right, let's reload. You never know what's gonna happen. I think that's the compound secure. Nope, compound not secure. Suicidal. Stunned him. The PSBL. The PSBL of hostile forces here. Hmm. Right, you. Fusion cells, 
point in that. I'm going to kill one over here. Oh yeah, that was him. Explosives box. I'll take the baseball grenades, even though they're technically useless for my character. Oh well. Okay, well, no one's still firing one from the house. So we'll take him out. A few swift bolts to the head. Hopefully. Dead dude. Mini nukes too. No, we don't want to get your mini nukes. But we'll take all the caps we can get here. These caps come in very handy for us. So I wonder why all the super mutants are around this one facility. I guess we're gonna go and find out in a few minutes. Uh, ammo. Uh, fusion cells. was one over here. Fusion cells. Guess they like their laser weaponry. Well this is West Tech. Found well the people made a lot of good weaponry a few other things. So let's go in then. Right, we're now entering the facility to take away hostile forces we may encounter. I think this might be today's full video guys is just me taking out everybody in this in this entire facility area. Possibly. And this is going to be one big facility, I can say that. And hopefully we'll get this quest done today. Learn the suits of West Tech. Nice lobby. Bit dark like. Can't really see what's going on. Let's turn on my torch then we can. So there's a door there. Research center. Front desk terminal. Let's have a read then. No Taurus, no Taurus. Um, November, may I please be more vigilant of the uninvited guests entering the lobby? We had an incident. This small man, a random stranger, entered the complex and approached the front desk. They looked and appeared like they were very fine in view, suit and tie, briefcase. They said they were here for a, co for a company tour. The person was not on the list of names or the date, and the security staff was not finding me. Right, this building is a secure facility. We are primed to have corporate espionage, sabotage, or investigative reports. If you say some something, say something. Okay. Intern mail. Recruitment. To Richard Burnley from Michelle Recruitment. Uh, look, Dick, I know you think it's funny throwing these BS degree kids my way, but I'm sick of it. The best candidates we've had in months was Eddie Ames, who, I'm sure you remember, rejected us. No thanks to you and your half-assed out research. I give you one last chance to prove you're good at your job. A father will be lucky if he sees the end of the month. Once he's gone, you you need to be there to point her in the right direction. You've got her address, but for what I hear, she's also joined up with those free state fanatics. If she's not home, she's got a bunker somewhere, so find that location where you need her. Once she's here, then we can talk promotion. Okay. Okay, now we've got another quest. Investigate her bunker. Well, I guarantee it's going to be in the Free State area. Someone's new from White Springs? Yeah. Right there. So we've got two of them now. Okay. Alright, we'll head through this one. He's down. Um, right, let's have a look through here. No protectors. Screw it, let's use the security terminal. Uh, okay, we need to use the terminal. So they controls, really. What am I doing? Some tugs here. What am I doing? I've got grenades. Stay out of the ground. I think we may just obliterate everybody in here. He's got the Yes, he's got one of the I want this sledge. Then things are obviously to damage. Okay, I did no damage. I'm doing no damage to him. What's going on? There we go. <laughs> oh man, he doesn't even have the weapon I want. Damn you. So he's got bored. 
What a super sledge, you know. That's a strange you can call on that. Oh, let's reload my weapon, man. Oh, let's click this terminal and have a read. Request approved. To West Tech, message delivery system, sir. Hello, this is an all made message from West Tech. You've received. Your recent request has been approved. Have a nice day. To West Tech security ticket system for the Protectron upgrade. New requests are at least three, sec three security protectrons or added safety and security covering of our facility. Staff currently does not have enough time to man the to contamination arches and patrol the facility and exterior grounds. Parts can be placed in security offices. Existing maintenance crews will be sufficient enough for this request. Okay, safe controls. Unlocked. Good. Decontamination arches. Activate. So now if we get any radiation, we can be clean. Tectrons. If there is any. Uh, two units. Yeah, that's activating them. They may kill me, but oh well. Can we change their protocols? Uh, default. Law enforcement. Fire brigade. Medical response. Law enforcement. Right, they're going to do some. Hopefully, they're going to do some. Law enforcement. Don't know whereabouts the Tektron bots are like, but we'll soon find them. Wander around, they'll probably end up attacking us, no my luck. But oh well, Federation officer can deal with them. Dirty army helmet. We'll take that because I know all my friends likes to collect them. So I will sell him that for, for 10 caps later. So that's the green price we agree on. Green bandana. No, but I am going to get rid of this use this disease cure so my strength is back up to par. Okay, this is how weird as to say. Facility. I'm going to say it leads into a big hall area, so we may go in there, we may not yet. So I want to explore where. Oh, chems smashing. Can I take these? Thank you. Just so I can sell them to vendors later on. So that's how I make all my caps. Selling drugs and alcohol and everything like that. A vendor box. So let's go back through here. Oh yeah. I didn't do the boxes, did I? Oh, so that's a like stuff is uh, engaged in a full out battle with Tectrons, so that's happy. So let's go this way. So what's this one? Research wing access terminal. Security door controls. Up here. Okay. Oh god. There's a mutant there. We may take him out in a minute. So there's a door down there. What's up here? I know I blasted out door, but there is a door control terminal. And it's just in gibberish. God, I don't know which way to go. I'd say we're just going to this area then. God, there's a friend in here. Oh god. Fall back. Screw up again. Oh god, these mobile chambers. I don't know where I go now. Right, screw it. We'll go back that way in a bit. But now we'll explore this moon. Maybe not. Okay, wherever we go, guys, we get out of hostile places. Oh god, there's no one mute. Jump in front of the bullets. We're taking out a lot of hostile forces here. Let's reload my gun as fast as we can. Job. I think we terminate everybody here. Sledgehammer, how much damage does that one do? Uh, it does. Is that more than my axe, I wonder? My axe does 178. I just don't know if I know it doesn't. Super Sledge will do the job, I'm pretty sure. I don't know where I go, guys. That's the thing. I'm trying to check and make sure my voice is being picked up. 
Hopefully it is. Oh man. I might I don't know why I'm going by, I'm gonna get lost in. Screw that. That's an I'm come to me. How's that sound? I'll shut this door. Do not follow it like car. Or we'll hide up there. Alright, this is the other blocked off door, right? So we seem to be entering a loop now. Okay. We'll go in this area then. I splatter your brain. You can splatter my brains anywhere you want. Just not right now. Okay, he's just that uh, mutant just sounded the alarm for anyone watching it. Biohazard looks like a drone stuff, yeah. Never mind biohazard. Why what they oh, this dog. Deal with the mutant pound straight away. And that mutant is over here, so it's getting smacked in the back. Are you guys upstairs shooting at me? Hold on then. Oh god. This place is a wreck, guys. Nope, I cannot jump it. Well, there is this dude who's trying to attack me, so... Super Sledge! Smashingly good. Yeah, 184. That's what I want. Super Sledge. You know I can do this thing wrong. Right, go up there. So how do I get up there? Screw it, let's just fire a hand grenade up there. Okay, let's do it here. I didn't need to pick that up. Whatever that was. Right, I want to get my home made out. I'm going to try and take out this dude up here. You should be causing a lot of trouble for me being up there. Is that it? I now explore this facility in peace and quiet <laughs> where I've been shot at a lot. Oh, this is how I get up there. Okay, that makes more sense. Right, well, read all them terminals once we've explored the ground floor. How's that sound? Sounds like a great idea. I think this might be a two part facility video as well, guys, by the amount of notes we've got here. Any terminals over here I can read? Nope. This is. Oh. Hello, buddy. Actually, I think I did pick up one more time. Yeah, that one. I'd love to know where you guys all came from as well. Is that another super sledge? This is. I'll take that one, scrap that one, so I'll get parts for this one. Seems like a sensible idea. Okay, we're in a room full of green fats now. Oh, you were doing shooting with the laser rifle before, so I'm definitely taking you out now. Right. So we took them out, we'll come into this room in a bit. And see what the, for now we're gonna go back down and explore the rest of this area. Right, so is that no nope, terminals blast out? So this seems to be like some sort of liquid room with a pole liquids or something. I'm not sure. Looks like doing a lot of garden type research thing. I'm not sure what was you can call it. It's like garden research I would say. <laughs> Whoa, there's a dude with a minigun up there. Yes, I am going up there now to take him out. I was going to go up the other stairwell, guys, and deal with him, but... I guess this dude has to be taken care of first. Where were you? No, there. No miniguns inside this lead for search, sleep, sir. Yeah, well, I'll teach you a lesson. Right, he's literally blasted this entire wall with pieces. Damn it! 
just what I did not require. I mean, more pit work to fill out. Facility. Oh, there's a new dog. Hi, doggy. What's this room? Research room, by the looks of it. Where's the place to put a park bench, may I say? Uh, microscopes or something? You put in this chamber. Possibly radioactive material? I'm not sure. This one looks like just to be a lot of lab equipment. Surgical tray, yeah, it's what's it now. Surgical trays get you like aluminum or aluminium, however you want to say it. That type of stuff. So that's always helpful. So, might as well, what's this? Access code. Okay, we've got an access code. Analyst's table. FTS, free air, detailed water qu quality report, error. Water analyzation. Water's analyzation report from field test at free air, Huntersville. The approved FEV strain has been introduced to the Huntersville water supply, while chlorine dioxide contained has been reduced slightly to decrease its effect at distinguishing the virus. No notable difference in the water quality should be detected by the population. We protected infected to be witnessed among the test subjects, but due to the nature of this strain, the results may appear slower than the constructed lab strain. Long-term physical attributions of the test subjects should greatly exceed average human levels with none of the side effects of the previous lab trials. So they were experimenting on Huntersville with FEV in the water supply there. Okay, let's see what else there is then. Formula adjustment. After the incident involving an unauthorized decision from FTS 54 there is a desire coming from way up. We come up with a solution that obligates that the need to terminate the viable test subjects. The purpose solution is to introduce a thermoric compound to mark the genetic course this way. If one gets loose again, we can use the hounds to track them down instead of the alternative. Oh, so that's why super mutant. That's why um, dogs are attracted to super mutants. It's because the pheromones the super mutants produce. So when the super mutants get the dogs, they must mutate them with FEV and turn them into hounds, I'm guessing. A change of course. Powers have decided that termination is the only viable solution to unauthorized desertion of the test subject. It has been determined that adding the pheromone compound to four has unfortunate side effects to, of producing a powerful, rather distinct scent that may draw closer to the site, which is in direct present to the intended effect of the quantity. Task has been placed on hold, but we are likely to be assigning a new department for further examination. Okay. That's interesting. So dogs were drawn to the facility. Terminals blasted out. Is there no such tree? Yes, it is. Terminals blasted out. So I haven't found much more notes than law here other than that. Okay, what's here? This looks like to be a control room of sorts. I'll take that other access code because you can never, never have too many access codes. Main terminal. Control room terminal. Technician's log 07-1677. Not much to report today. The FEV tanks are starting to bring some leaks where the founding lines are now, but it shouldn't take more than a day or two to span out the O-rings. It's messy work, but Lucky Spurman drew the short straw and he have to start and go deep in the sludge until we can probably get it cleaned up. The FEV is vol volatile stuff. It grids the vacuum rubber on those seals, seals like it was acid. Strangely, there is no acid content of it at all. It must have been a side effect, the old rings on the modular level. It kind of makes me wonder if it's safe to have it pooling up on the floor. I guess I cannot say half these words today. Uh, next one, technician's log 08 or 277. Carwell fell into one of those tanks days, poor bastard. He was wearing full biohazard gear, but he was most certainly dead when they pulled him out. The suit must have gotten breached on the way in or something because they had not even came up for air or called for help. They didn't even know he had fallen in until they drained the tank. Man, that twisted look on Crawford's face. Ugh, it's gonna give me the creeps to sing about it. Thank God West had given us that has a pay, boys. Always I'll be out of here. Technician's log 102377. 
I can't believe those idiots actually did. They blew up the goddamn world. Like, lucky we were inside the facility when the bombs hit. Supervisor Bradwell begged us to stay with the FEV tanks until, until he checked with top brass, but all the communication lines are down. Tillman and I think of bolting, but I guess we'll give Bradwell a day to figure out what to do. It's not like I have a home to go back to anyway. Technician's log, 10 face I mean, Bauer decided to, to, to make contact with the US Army in Huntersville. While I was six days ago, he hasn't come back. Told if anything went south to dump the neutralization into the FEV tanks, Roman and I followed orders and made sure that the job was done before we abandoned West Tech. We confirmed that the lo liquid in the tanks was neutralized, still highly toxic, but at least the FEV was gone. Well, that's it for sure. I'm going to stick with Selman for a while and hopefully we can make it somewhere safe. Whenever that might be. A remote door open. So, basically, Huntersville made some. Uh, so, this people made FAV, experimented on people. They neutralized it, but the super mutants must be drawn to Huntersville because the war supply was contaminated with FAV as well, but it didn't neutralize Huntersville's war supply. Ah, so that's how super mutants can appear in that latcher. Thanks to Huntersville. Okay, maybe we should just nuke Huntersville and like obliterate it off the map, possibly. That might be the best course of action to get rid of this mutants once and for all in that last year. So can we actually jump in these and we won't be affected? Yeah. Oh well we're not turning to mutants. Can we actually get back out of these or not? No. Oh well I'm have to jump out of oh, this power armor then to get back up. Oh. God. Even if I have aqua pack. Alright, there is some stuff down here though, but I am heavily over encumbered, so it might not help me. Apparently I am. Oh by one thing, so I think let's let's just drop the baseball grenades. So let's have a look. So that goes down there. That's over there. I think in this tank. Even though this is FAB, looking if we can go swimming around in it. Uh, footlocker. Oh, there's a fat man there. That could be fun to use, but I'm not going to restart using nuclear weapons every day. I'd say that. So we're going to just continue looking around. Toxic goo. So this must be an FAB strain. Oh, it's like a chair or something. Where? Yeah, is this what they've dipped people in? So like a person would be clamped in there? Possibly. Strange. Very strange. Might try and get a picture of this from a thumbnail actually. Let's have a look, shall we? Uh, actually I know what I'm trying to do actually. Let's get my power armor out again. Jump in. It may look like we fell into the sludge and we're dying. How does that sound for a thumbnail? It sounds like an epic thumbnail, should I say? So let's quickly jump in this water and get this thumbnail and jump out of my power arm and jump back up. I know it's contradictory, but oh well. Can I like access forward mode? Yes, I can. can I? Oh man, I can't do a pause in the water. They removed the accessibility. They used, used to be able to do pauses in the water, guys. Like weeks ago, they used to be able to do it, but I guess we best have patched it for some strange reason. That's not nice, but best. I like doing pauses in the water. But oh well. Let's do a terrifying. What should we do? Thumbs up? No, I got the tar. Yeah, well. yeah, let's go for a masculine one. Uh, I don't need that. Got my pistol. Oops, I fired that. So if I do my heroic pose, it keeps the pistol in my hand, you see. Like that. There we go. Right now, below. Uh, that's a bit too green, I would say. Can we turn that down? No. Nah, not green enough. Black and white. Ah, that's it. That's gonna make it nice and toxic green, I would say. Yeah, it looks like a pretty darn horrible toxic sludge. Let's put on like a nice good old effect. Yeah, like that. Let's get a look at a fun fun nail for today's video. Toxic sludge what eats humans or something along them lines. So we've been down there, we've been this one right, so we'll jump down over here. 
Okay, let's explore this downstairs area and see what there is. So we have a Tinkerer's workbench. There's a plan here. Oh, mattresses? Oh. Actually, I'll take that because if I find a lower level, I can give uh, that to a lower level player. Because that's what I like doing now and then, guys. I like just running around in my free time finding low level players and just going, yeah, I have these plans for free. And they're like, are you not going to kill me or anything? I'm like, no. I'm not a harsh player who likes to target low level players and kill them. I'm just here to give you some free plans. Let's have a look. So this must be the research wing or something like that. Yes. West access terminal. Right, we'll have a look at that in a minute. I believe there is always... I'm in the right power armor. Drop power armor and go. Get in it. <laughs> I may be in combat armor, but this is super mutant. I am not to the risk of dying to this point. Right, where's my super sledge? Well, let's have a look. Oh, what's this room? Lab access terminal. Okay. Oh, yeah, interest. So this is where they must... T45 ball. Oh, nothing really helpful there. So this is where they must sort out the liquid for the tanks and the rest. So I guess we'll head over to that room now then, I guess. Hmm. So let's go to this room then, open this door, and see what's happening. Security door, open. Hello. Okay, there's a dead scientist there. Run into the world's biggest firefight, guys. Yeah, have a good one. That's all guys. Let's execute him. I don't know what that is, it's just going to be on the screen about hours, but I'm going to have a look when I'm at it in the video, hopefully there'll be quite a lot of hours. Is that everybody? Or is there someone up above me? Well, you can stay up there for a second while I just grab. Super Sledge. Super Sledge. By the same way, I'll be getting a lot of parts of Super Sledges to do, guys. Right, let's leave them ones. Let's grab the majority of the super mutants by the looks of it here. Right. Hopefully they won't attack us. So we were in here doing some research. So that's the upstairs. What's this? Restricted area. Oh my god. Yeah, they're just gonna keep attacking me on. Let's take you guys out. Let's look at the Super mutants are not everyone's good friends. This stuff comes so much to you. Now you go down there. You, I'll take your loose screws. So what's this room? Looks like we have a lab of some sorts. Guess we'll just start with this room. And just start taking more of what we can. What's in this room? Another lab? And a deep determination arch. Hmm. Let's have a look. Decontamination art. Right, so let's see, let's see if I'm breaking into this one because normally I'm not very good at these, as you already know. Oh, there we go. Right. Technician's log 0503. Brown Wells all over my ass about getting the decontamination's arches up and run. How the hell am I supposed to come up with a decontamination method? Well, something that's totally experimental. 
To make my West West Tech HQ refuse to give me the FEV chemical uh, organic breakdown. So I'm totally shooting in the dark. My degree in biochemistry never prepared me for this, but I should have known things would be difficult around here when I get high level clearance just to walk in the door. Or five twenty-two. Uh three weeks three weeks and about sixty compounds there, I've still got nothing. FEV is something tremendous stuff. I know the FEV is very smooth, so unfortunately from the angle unfortunately even antibiotic compound known to man isn't designed to handle something this well. Volatile what I need to come with is some sort of booster to totally neutralize the agent that will render the FEV back to the drop. Antibiotics will not kill a virus. Even I know that. O six eleven. Picture this, Bravo standing there in his biohazard suit yelling at me to get my ass moving on the decontamination. Wench sneaks up right behind him and dumps a cast of FAV right over his head. Should have seen his face, he freaked the hell out. He was screaming, rolling around on the floor. Hell, I think he was crying. I let it go for almost a full minute before I activated the arches and let my neuralization wash him off. Wear it like a charm. I'm on the crap detail for the next two weeks of doing that to him, but it was totally worth it. I agree, I would have done the same. Six. But I was still pissed about my decontamination, but my demonstration, but at least he's quit shouting at me. I spent the last few days calculating thousands of gallons of neutralizing agent, but not only for use in decontamination, but in the case I allegedly dumped into the tank. Apparently the folks by West Tank HQ wants it rip cord just in case this place is in danger of being Capture or something. If you ask me, they are paranoid, but I just do as I'm told. Like a little robot. Okay, let's activate the archers then. I still find that funny how they dumped it over his head. Let's go through them. Make sure I'm not contaminating anything. Alright, so we want to go over here and meet this terminal. Uh, what's in this room? Let's say it's just more labs, so we'll read them in a minute. I guess, but we'll go downstairs first and read this terminal. So this is like some sort of super mutant FEV type room. And tanks are flickering like mad. Right, specimen contamination terminal. Warning, system offline. Test subject control group. Unit 1. Very good, it's 48 hunters fail so these are all residents so i'm not going to read the names because i can't really pronounce proper names like human names very well oh that one's just blank empty there's that one he's a farmer from hunters fail uh wait waitress hunters fail counting hunters fail so yeah these are all people uh non or your patient hunt as well, so it's just an OEP, audience person, an empty. Contaminate, contamination risk, system offline. Okay, so the terminal's completely blank. Oh well. Alright, let's continue looking around downstairs then. So this is like a super mutant autopsy room or something like that. So this might explain we found super mutant parts over here. Could West Tech be dumping super mutant parts in radioactive barrels there? Which says radioactive waste? Possibly. That's one theory I'm thinking. I don't know. Uh, let's take that disease cure just in case. Toxic goo. This is a super mutant that died, obviously. Recently, because the corpse hasn't decayed or anything. So, a small group then. These chairs look to be sticking needles in or something into them. I'm not too sure on that one. Combination rest. What's where's this door take? Oh, out here. Okay. Uh, there's a terminal there when you read. So, oh, there's a dead soldier here. And oh, this is the body I killed right near the start. Canisters. Handcuffs. Down there. It's dead people. We'll go into that room in a second. Nope. Let's use the proper doorway. Okay. Maybe it's a different doorway. You can hear the things upstairs. Mentats. So these are like holding cells or something like that. Yeah, they look to be like real holding type test subject cells. Hmm. Okay. Nothing much 
should have been trust here or can say that. So alright, let's go back to this way and go into this room, I guess. Uh that. So this is like an incineration room or something like that. This looks to be like some sort of incineration room or something, possibly. I'm not sure. This door does lock. So I'm not sure what that's for. Like. Hmm, strange. But oh well, let's read the terminal and find out. Advanced Mutations Lab Terminal. Advanced Mutations Program. So immune program has shown great promise by tweaking genomes. They are able to calculate different strains of the virus, which provides yielding results. Most strains provide highly unstable results. Few are valuable only again. Genetic technical above the clearance level 5 are allowed access to the FAV recalibration, given prior approval by Dr. V. Test subjects reports. Status report Chem contamination breach. Uh, test subject A52 has breached containment. Tracking program initiated. Tracking unit signal weak. Tracking coordinates 38, 13, 22, 14. 80234 West. Ah, subject extremely dangerous. Kill or capture. Kill or recapture, I'd say. So I wonder if we can track down that screen, possibly. I don't know how you would do it, but it might be. Test subject AM48. Uh, subject A48 is the closest we've come so far to a, to a substantial form. Despite the substantial breakthrough, A48 was declared deceased. A Mere 12 minutes and 43 cents after being released from the in chamber, it seems to cu current combination strain FEVS005938 where the subject's lungs useless without artificial respirator. Suitable subjects may have been difficult to come by, so control experiments were extremely limited going forward. Several sites have volunteered their displease, displeasure, but this is what we've been handed with. Test subject if AM49. One of the genomes in FABs O00618 produced unstable fail results in subject A49. All subjects' organ tissues were eventually replaced with visceral vertebral tissues, rendering it terminally as the majority of its organs ceased to function. Upon further study, it was determined that FABS006186 was contaminated. Okay, test subject three. Hold on, I'm just going to extend it. I've just extended the clock a little so we can get through this one building. AM50 was tainted with FEVS 006309. Subject self terminated 12 days into the program where its own upper cluster increases. It's something something leading to rapid loss of organ function. This is this something A50 of seem to be developing quite well. Why we should have modified the strain and removed the mutations towards rapid new development successful. Half these words I can't say guys. Sorry to say that very scientifically. A51. We have a near success with test subject A51. While FAV006378 has produced with mobile science have proclaimed nightmare including results that have subjects more or less biological stability. Seems capable of surviving one on its own but there were indication that it was constantly in traumatic pain, indeed to the point of self indicating termination harm shortly after being left in isolation termination after its enduring period. An old toys revealed a hyperactive nervous system that may have been in construction development stages since FEVSO006378 was administered. Test subject A52. Phase 2 combination strain 006443 has finally tainted to test subject A52 and no results in pile of something bio waste. F2 commerce resembles a number of different species. These results are disturbing to say the least. We have learned valuable insight into what these new strains are capable of. Most notable about subjects are the above original organs along with enlarged upper torsos, a second set of arms aiding in crawling and large sickle shaped claws on each inner toe. That living stale form subject seems to be 
So the saying itself normally is I'm joint. So they're describing a uh, what you call them senator or something like that from Fallout 3 by the sounds of it. I'll try and remember to put up a picture because you might be able to see what it looks like. We will keep a subject if to a nice time for observation until if three is finished in English. If the two are able to co cohabitate along with a strain mutated human test subject, we may try introducing them to hunt as they'll side for further study. Okay, test subject A53. Based on the success with A52, there were conflict and tweaking FU genes so from FEVSO0065A. Pushed the subject group too large to contain in the containment unit broke, but A53 was unharmed indeed despite this and its pure lack of survival. Subject AM3 was supervised as for extreme. Since our containment unit was insufficient to hold the subject, we have arranged for immediate transport off site under super under saturation for our visit to A53 will be scheduled for observation and recording. Okay, that's interesting. Security door controls. That's that. So this is where they were keeping them contained. And I got some caps for completing that quest. So let's go upstairs then and finish up looking around up here. So we've been in there. We've been in there. I think in here. All these like medical pods or something. Okay. We'll go in there in a minute, what's through here? Oh, that's the other door, right, so there's only this last area to look around. So these look to be holding cells of some sort. Again, more creepy holding cells. Oh, there's a note here. Let's play and listen. Okay, that's interesting. Pretty barbaric what they were doing here, but oh well. Right, memo. Sick minor. Okay. All of the soldiers are exposed to FEV, so they will see the symptoms of flu like virus. If they are at this stage, there is no cause for alarm. Continue monitoring their condition. Oh, sick monitor. Sick major. If subject is having violent seizures or attack, issue a cold blue alert and con. Attack the duty supervise me. Do not attempt any type of resuscitation without direct authorization. Death. If subject dies, do not issue an alarm. Contact duty supervise and they will instruct you on what to do with the boy. Now, when handling organic matter, biocontamination procedures are in full effect. Violent. Basically, it becomes violent enough that you fear for their own safety or the safety of all of our personnel. Issue a code red alert and wait. Security, do not attempt to restrain status or assist any, any subject in this state. Holding cell controls. Open. Okay. Let's begin emergency lockdown. Oh wow, that literally locks all the cells. That's pretty cool. Okay then. Well, that's this video done, guys. This is West Tech Research Facility. Fully explored and done. So we now know what happened here. No matter, I'll play Mr. Terminal or something somewhere, but 
At least we got the majority of the history of ours. So they basically poisoned Hunt as well and used them as a test subject for FEV virus. Very horrible, nasty stuff to do to innocent people. I can say that, guys. Very not nice to the people of Huntersville. So that's, hopefully we can load out this door. And hopefully we don't get disconnected from the world or anything like that. Oh, right, we're now out to the door. So yeah, guys. Our next goal is to go down there, so that's where I'm going to go in the next video. But for this video, guys, if you liked it, give that thumbs up. If you didn't like, give it that thumbs down. But if you have any questions at all about this video or any other videos like that, guys, put them in the comments below and I will try and answer them the best of my ability I can, guys. But until next time, I am Victor Barisov signing off. Until next time, guys. Bye.